Hey guys, uh, I represent uh, Aften Posten local team and I would like to tell you something about real-time analysis of clickstrip that we made uh, during past weeks. Uh, so basically, during the presentation, I will need your help. Uh, so please uh, take your phones and be sure that you are uh, logged into our Wi-Fi. Uh, you will help me later. Um, okay. Uh, why we did this uh, real-time uh, click stream ana analysis? Basically, the root cause or the key question was how we can help our journalist uh, to create better content. Um, and the answer is by giving them very fast feedback about how the story they published uh, is performing right now. Uh, it's very important to understand that story lives only for a few hours. So uh, first minutes after publishing uh, the story are crucial. For example, uh, how story will uh, propagate uh, across social media. Um, okay, but how we can achieve that? Uh, basically, by very fast analysis of click stream coming from our publication. Uh, but how fast? The best way in real time. Uh, okay, how to do that? Are we able to create such, uh, such a system? Uh, we didn't knew that. Uh, so if we don't try, we will never know if this is possible. Um, what was the surrounding for us? Uh, we had to use um, systems that we already had implemented on our publication. So the obvious choice was to use web hits as a click source of click stream uh, on our publication because we don't own uh, our own infrastructure. So uh, the choice was to go for a cloud solution. Uh, and because this is a proof of concept project, uh, so we need to be, we, uh, the, yeah, we had to build a lightweight um, application to present a simp simple chart. Few words about software architecture. So what you can see here, these are the three big um, infrastructure layers. So the green one represents Shipstead IT, where uh, Aften Posten is hosted. Uh, also Web Hits is posted, uh, hosted on uh, Shipstead IT. So what we did, we installed Flume uh, to tail the logs coming from Web Hits. Um, yes, what next? Uh, because we don't own our own infrastructure, so we decided to use uh, Amazon uh, Web Services uh, as a storage for, uh, for our data. So in this particular case right now, we are using Kinesis uh, on Amazon. Uh, we potentially in the future will save all data coming from uh, Aften Posten into Hadoop uh, on AWS. Uh, but now we are streaming this log uh, into our applications on Heroku. Uh, the first application basically is a Python script that parses the log and saves uh, aggregated data uh, into memcacher. Uh, and the other application is the simple application that reads data from memcacher and present it uh, in the browser. We use to that purpose high charts. Um, okay, how does it look in practice? Um, uh, what, uh, about what kind of data uh, we are uh, talking? So each second we, had over, we have over 100 uh, rows of log. Uh, so it gives us about four gigabytes uh, data each day. Uh, what is the delay from event on our site and when we record that? Uh, it's basically from three to five seconds. Uh, isn't this too long? Uh, you may ask. Uh, yes, we are still working to shorten this uh, time, but yet uh, we already know that you visited our page before it's fully rendered in your browser. So it's quite, quite okay for now. Uh, okay, and as I said before, I will use your help uh, during live demo. So please prepare your phones. Um, Okay, so these are the simple charts uh, we prepared. Uh, the first one, uh, this is the aggregated clicks for, for each uh, media house, for BT, FVN, Aften, Posten, uh, and SA. Uh, all clicks are filtered by our uh, IP local. So if you would like to see some changes here, let's say guys from FVN, 
please go to your site and start refreshing the front page. Uh, we will see the numbers uh, growing here. Okay, the second chart is this is the stream of clicks uh, that are happening right now uh, thanks to you. Uh, so we are actually uh, incre increasing the counter uh, each time uh, we get a uh, data stream from, uh, from uh, Kinesis and from uh, our publications. Uh, and the third chart uh, will show you um, the statistics uh, about how many visits are coming from Facebook and how many are coming uh, from unknown uh, referrer for now. So that's it. Uh, if it comes to the live uh, presentation of our charts, uh, let's get back to presentation. Uh, okay, uh, probably you would like to ask some questions. Uh, why to build uh, our own system? Why not to use something else? Of course, we have WebKit implemented on Aften Post 10. Uh, it's a very cool uh, tool, it works, but uh, it doesn't support the real-time uh, statistics. Um, some of you may heard about Charbit. Yes, we are testing that on Oslo BNO right now. Uh, what is the business value of uh, this project? Uh, basically, the first is that we will fully control our data. Um, if we go for Hadoop on Amazon, we can extend uh, data sources and run more complex queries between, uh, against different uh, data sources. Uh, and hopefully in the future, we will be able to build uh, our own tool for A-B tests. Uh, how long, how much time did we spend uh, on this project? We started uh, at the beginning of September with no knowledge about uh, Amazon Cloud solutions uh, in terms of big data. So that's all. Thank you very much. <laughs>